Globally, there are 12 species of megapods. The megapods are of three kinds scrub fowl, brush turkeys, which are actually not true turkeys, and malay fowls or low ones. They are also called as mound builders or incubator birds because they bury their eggs mainly relying on the fermenting plant matter to hatch them. Nicobar scrub fowls are also known as Nicobar megapods. They are a vulnerable species, endemic and restricted to the Nicobar Islands. They have a body length of 14 to 18 inches and weigh approximately 600 to 800 grams. They lay around 4 to 5 eggs and the incubation period takes 70 to 80 days. They are large brownish birds having a grey head and bare reddish facial skin. Megapods are so named for their large feet and claws, fowl-like dark brown plumage and a short tail. During the day, they move around in thick jungle adjacent to the seashore. In the dark, they venture out on the shore and move in pairs or small groups. Young birds have a fully feathered face, hatchlings are small, quail-like with rufous barring on the wings and back. Males and females are very similar but the male is dark brown overall while the female has more grey on the underparts. Pairs indulge in duet calling and maintain territories. They are omnivorous birds foraging mainly by scratching and raking debris on the ground using their feet. Their food consists of mainly seeds followed by insects, snails, crustaceans and reptiles. They may also eat gravel to help their stomach digest. They build a large mound nest, generally close to the coast. Mounds are constructed with coral sand containing minute shells and plant materials such as leaves, twigs and other debris. Unpaired mature males build and defend mounds to attract a partner. A single mound may be used by more than one pair of birds. Eggs are elongate, elliptical in shape and pinkish without marking or gloss. They don't take responsibility in incubating their eggs. Eggs are laid on a mound of decaying vegetation, which generally hatches due to the heat generated from the decomposing matter. Peak egg laying period is from February to May. Immediately after hatching, the chicks are independent and can run and fly. They don't need any parental care. They are not good flyers but can run very fast. As per the Wildlife Institute of India's research findings, more than 70% of the population have disappeared over the last 12 years. Currently only 788 breeding pairs of megapods are left in the coastal regions of Nicobar Islands. Clearly, sea level rise is of significant future concern and is expected to lead to a reduction in their nesting habitats. To conserve the endemic species and the Indian biodiversity hotspots, on October 2012, a set of four commemorative stamps of the Nicobar megapods with a face value of 5 Indian rupees were released. They are threatened by hunting and are highly vulnerable to extinction. The 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami is believed to have drastically reduced their populations.